Finally, the Durham investigation. I'm tired of hearing John Durham this, John Durham that. <laughs> Obviously, he doesn't want to uh, solve the case, or he would have said months ago, look, I can't solve it, get someone else, or here's what I've got. And he doesn't say anything to continue on. Uh, we're going into year four now on it. It's absurd. Is it not absurd? It is absurd. Uh, I will tell you that the combination of the Hunter Biden, you know, refusal to investigate an easy case, a simple case, uh, and the Durham length of time that it's taken, it, it combines to just send the message that there's a double standard in our justice system and we have to sit back and endure it. And, and it's unacceptable. It is because it's not supposed to be equal justice for all in this country. It's a pillar of the Constitution. Hunter Biden, do you expect them ever to get indicted? Because the the testimony is there. All right. The grand jury did sit for all of those years. Everything is on the record. Do you expect him to be indicted? I expected it a long time ago. This is the kind of case where they could have very easily charged this in the first few months after receiving the laptop. Now, like you pointed out, you have a grand jury that doesn't sit past three years. So did they get an indictment and it's just been sealed and we don't know about it? Or do they have to reconvene a grand jury to review what they presented in order to, to pursue it? And if it's the latter, I think we're going to be out of luck. All right, Brett, we appreciate it. Keep an eye. Anything you have, please let us know. And, uh, you know, I think we have done our duty here as journalists to give the American people uh, an exact update on to where we are. Let's get to President Biden. He had nothing on his schedule today. Held a couple of meetings. Um, didn't matter. Uh, however, I wrote a column, uh, President Biden's Battle of the Bulge, over the weekend. It's on BillOReilly.com. It's an important column. And, you know, everybody's running around having fun. You might have missed it. I hope you read it. And it was off the speech last Thursday where uh, Biden attacked Trump and the MAGA people as fascists. Uh, ridiculous speech. I watched it. Totally absurd. Uh, no point in it. But it was Biden who did that. The, his advisors, I understand, did not want that speech to be given. But Biden himself wanted to do it and did it. Now, uh, yesterday, Labor Day, went to Milwaukee, Wisconsin. And here's what the president said. Go. Nearly 10 million new jobs, more jobs than never been created at this point in any presidency in history. Wages are up. Unemployment remains near a 50-year low. And the big reason for all this is the American Rescue Plan that I signed into law shortly after taking office. With the help of your Democratic members of Congress, that's how we got it done. Not one single Republican vote. That's because the bill was inflationary. Of course, uh, Joe Biden doesn't mention inflation, any of this. Why would he? It's a disaster. He doesn't mention the stock market is imploding. That's a disaster. He doesn't mention the real estate business in uh, America is in recession. That's a disaster. He doesn't mention anything other than 10 million jobs, new jobs have been created. Well, that's bogus because he's starting when the country shut down for COVID. And all jobs were, most jobs were lost. That's his starting point. Okay, I mean, but regular people don't know this. You know it if you watch and listen to me, but regular people don't know, oh, 10 million jobs, hey, you must be doing a great job. Hey, come on, will you? I mean, this is the three, this is a show game. Inflation at its highest level in 40 years, interest rates skyrocketing, we all know that. Market experts like Jamie Dimon, CEO of JP Morgan, not only predict a recession, but are using scary terms like economic hurricane and unprecedented. So you need to call the only precious metal dealer I trust, American Hartford Gold. They will show you how to protect your savings and retirement accounts by diversifying your portfolio with physical gold and silver. Please call them today and they will have physical gold and silver delivered right to your door or put inside your IRA or 401k. They have thousands of satisfied customers of the highest rated firm in the country with an A-plus rating from the Better Business Bureau. Tell them Bill O'Reilly sent you and they'll give you up to $2,500 of free silver on your first order. Please call 866-501-5201, 866-501-5201, or text BILL to 65532. Again, 866-501-5201 or text BILL to 
3-2. Bill O'Reilly here. Thank you for watching this video and make sure you subscribe to the First TV YouTube page. Just hit the big red subscribe button below and you'll get clips and highlights of my program, The No Spin News, every single day. We'll see you soon.